Welcome to the first video in a long while and it's an unboxing. The weather's been okay to fly um, for various personal reasons we haven't been. Um, yeah, I thought I'd try my luck on this. I thought it was a three battery version I'd bought but it's just a one battery version from eBay. Less than £40, the KF615. Looks like the DJ Avata, Avatar FPV drone. Obviously, it's not nowhere near. Um, and it says it's all FPV and things, but obviously that's the 2.4 gigahertz signal to your phone via the app. Um, looked quite good. thought it was substantially bigger than this. It's about 10 centimetres, this drone. We'll cover that in a minute, but sneaky peek there. There is a nice box inside, which is kind of cool for this class of drone. I mean, as I say, it was under £40 delivered. Came within a week and a bit. I don't know whether it came from China or a, a local warehouse. Got all sorts of postage problems in the UK at the moment. Currently December 2022. Bob goes, bugs are on strike due to uh, wanting a decent pay rise. But there's uh, quite a lot of people wanting that due to the inflation. Let's not get political. Here's a drone. Mini FPV is stamped on the uh, body there. And as I say, I was kind of taken aback at how small it actually was. Nice case though, as you can see. In the back there you can see spare props for it, full set, and a charger. Um, the camera's adjustable, I'll show that shortly. And that grill at the front does actually light up, I thought it was just a gimmicky thing. There you go, you can adjust it with your hand there, the camera. Yeah, not that you would, I'll just keep it facing forward I think when I fly it. Um, kind of like a whoop style in terms of protecting the props. Whether it'll hamper or help fly, I have no idea. And there also seems to be underneath a um, like a, a, a camera facing down for um, like a positional hold. I've forgotten the name of it now. It'll come to me. The, motion, the remote control is really tiny as well. And that's full set of props. Padded feet that you stick on yourself and the charger. Um, phone holder. I know that phone's holding down, but it just pushed back up afterwards. Got quite a good stretch on that. Here we go, measuring up. It's, it's probably 12 centimetres prop. Um, motor to motor diagonally across but it's about 10 centimeters long it's, it's not very big at all thought it'd be much much bigger more substantial uh, very tiny not going to try it in the current weather rainy and wet but that's after a decent cold snap so um what else can i say this is quite jazzy i thought it'd be monstrously much bigger than this and not all crass and lit up and i'm sure it does when you get the batteries in i just haven't got the batteries proprietary battery in the back can't find anywhere how big it is um or small but it's got to be a 1s affair due to the 60 minute um time it's quoted in the manual is taking to charge and the fact it's just got one of those tiny sort of pinhole charge things there you can see the port um as i say i thought i'd order the three battery version cheap get that i am i probably didn't i'll check the manual itself looks you know fairly self-explanatory if you've never drone we've flown a drone before it covers all the basics um i couldn't see how to calibrate it though so i'll have a look at that a bit more in depth before we fly because i don't want it going all scooby with on its first flight uh, that's how to charge it it's in english and then chinese at the back uh, a few helpful hints about the buttons i think i'll familiarize myself a bit more as i say with how they all work soon enough before i take it to the air and then um, moving on how to do the app and stuff is covered on this sticky page here there we go with all the qr codes and things so yeah um interesting little drone not sure what we'll make of it hope it flies nice um hope those prop guard protectors keep it all nice and uh, tidy etc from uh, Terrible flying. We've not flown a lot recently at all. Unboxing video is a bit longer than normal. And I am running out of things to say, which is weird. Because I should be saying lots more information, I'm sure. Um, so a small DJ avatar replica. Avatar? I don't know why you pronounce it. LEDs to either side. And as I say, the blue grilly thing in the middle does light up too. Ooh. And uh, yeah, there's the sensor underneath. Again, the name escapes me. Comment below, please do. Um, <clears throat> I know the Tello's got one as well. Or has it got two? Anyway, yeah. Um, the 
KF Plan KF. I've got 615, everyone. Like and subscribe. See you on the next one.